look an absolute mess. Ugh, go away, Alistair. Mm. Now, now, is that any way to act after picking a fight with all of heaven and dooming everyone you love? Ugh, I have enough on my mind without hearing your sadistic idea of a joke, asshole. Who's joking? <laughs> you have a captive audience downstairs waiting to hear what kind of inspiring performance you have planned next. Ugh, I can't. How can I face them after failing them all so hard? They came here to be saved and all I gave them was more pain. Just as bad as the cruelest overlord in hell, and maybe worse. At least they don't go around giving false hope. Wow, I never expected to see such a miserable display of self-loathing from you. Oh, fuck you, Alistair. All you do is stand there smiling while you watch us struggle and fail. I don't know how you can enjoy all this suffering so much. <laughs> Duh. Just because you see a smile, don't think you know what's going on underneath. A smile is a valuable tool, my dear. It inspires your friends and keeps your enemies guessing. And ensures that no matter what comes your way, you're the one in control. But I'm not! I'm the farthest thing from in control. The person I trust most has been lying to me for years. Heaven refuses to listen. Even if they did, I can't prove that the hotel works. Adam has an invisible exorcist army pointed right at my doorstop, and there's nothing I can do about any of it. I know something you don't know. Huh? Those big scary angels are not quite as indestructible as they seem. What are you talking about? Just that you and your little band of misfits might stand more of a chance than you think. Ow! I'll do anything! Anything? Well then, let's make a deal. You... You want my soul? Your soul! Heavens no! All I need from you is one itty bitty favor. What's a favor between friends? I won't hurt anyone for you. Who's asking? One favor at a time of my choosing where you harm no one. In return, I tell you what I know. Do we have a deal? Deal. No, no! Lights on cue. 